Hi again everybody, so this is going to be the second video in my little mini series about uh, people who wear contacts and who also like to wear a lot of eye makeup. So if you didn't watch the first video, go check it out. It is all about how to take care of your contact lenses if you wear makeup. And this video is going to be about certain makeup items and also makeup remover that is targeted towards people who wear contacts. So first, I'll start out with eyeliner and mascara. Um, if you wear contacts, you probably have had this happen before. Um, like if I buy a certain eyeliner and put it on, I'll get a little black line on my contact from where the eyeliner transferred onto my contact. That is extremely irritating to your eyes and pretty um, bad for the contacts too. So these are some eyeliners that I found that work really well for my contacts. Once you put them on your waterline or your tight line or any part on your eye, they will stay on and not transfer onto your contact. So number one um, eyeliner that I recommend if you wear contacts are the Revlon Colorstay Eyeliners. I have one in cocoa. I try to block out my lamp again. Oops. Just. I'm sorry. There we go. Revlon Color Stay Eyeliner in cocoa. And then I also have this um, other one that's just in black. These two are the crayon, or I guess pencil eyeliners. I just say crayon because they're like the twist up kind. And then I also have um, a liquid eyeliner pen from my long color stay as well. These are really, really amazing. Never transfer under your contacts. I've tried um, some lower end ones. I mean, these are drugstores, so I guess they're low end. But, you know, two or three dollar ones that'll do that. I also have Mary Kay ones that'll do that. And a Smashbox one. Same thing. So, don't waste your money on high-end eyeliners. And just get the Revlon Colorstay Eyeliners. They work really well. Um, I can list the prices down below. Mine are five dollars at my local Walmart. So, that's a, a really good deal. So, next recommendation for mascara if you wear contacts. Number one, I would try to find a lengthening formula even if you want volume. I know it's kind of a stupid thing to recommend, but almost every volumizing mascara I have tried um, crumbles off and falls onto my contacts. And since I have dry eyes already, it just sticks on the contact. So that's why I recommend a lengthening formula. Usually they're um, a little wetter and they won't crumble off your eyes. Also, I would recommend a waterproof mascara if you wear contacts because you know if you have any sort of watery eyes or eye irritation, your eyes are going to tear up and this will just help it so it doesn't come off. So my favorite mascara of all time, <laughs> well currently at least, is the Maybelline Lash Stiletto Ultimate Length Mascara, and this is the waterproof one. I've taken out the package, but I tried to make it look more professional. <laughs> anyway, if you want to know what it looks like, it's this red package, black tube, and it has a little red thing. Um, I think the difference you can tell between the other packages, for which one's waterproof, is that this one has the little blue brush, and it says waterproof. So, definitely try this out. It will never flake off into your contacts. I haven't had any sort of irritation with it. Um, like I said, with a lot of volumizing ones, when I put them on, they're kind of like goopy, and then I can like feel it sucking the moisture out of the contacts. This one never happens with that. Um, and also, the brush is pretty nice, and it won't scratch your contacts or anything. I'm taking it out of the package so I can show you the brush if you're curious. So again, 
There's the little waterproof part. And this is the brush. It's a pretty typical lengthening brush. That's not all I have to say. <laughs> really good. I'd recommend that. Um, if you do not like waterproof mascara, which I understand it's hard to get off and sometimes um, I think it dries out people's eyelashes or, you know, that's what they tell me. I've never had that happen personally. These are two little samples that I've been using for the past month and these are regular mascaras. Um, they don't flake off or anything like that either and are non-irritating towards my contacts. I don't know if they're specifically made that way, but that's just um, from my experience. So this is by the brand Tarte and this is their Multiply mascara and it's so it's clinically proven lash enhancing mascara. Um, I just got some samples from a Sephora Beauty Insiders little gift bag. So there's that one. And the second one is the Sephora Advanced Lash Booster. There you go. The only thing um, why these aren't my number one favorite or anything is that they don't hold the curl on your eyelashes very well. But they're non-irritating really good. Okay, so the next thing, I guess I didn't include this in a makeup item, but this is for people who have, um, who wear contacts and like to wear false eyelashes. I don't wear them regularly, but I do sometimes. And the eyelash glue that I like is the Duo Eyelash Adhesive in the Waterproof one. Again, this doesn't irritate my eyes or anything. It doesn't crumble off or flake off, and it won't get stuck in your contacts. So, that's a really good product if you like to wear fake eyelashes. Okay, so I think that's it for the makeup items. I didn't really include any specific eyeshadows or anything. I haven't had a lot of problem with eyeshadows falling into my contacts, but I have with mascara and eyeliner, definitely. Okay. The next thing I wanted to talk about was eye makeup remover. Either of those, so this is my number one recommendation. It's two fluid ounces, pretty average size, and this is 99 cents right on. <laughs> so that's also a little bonus. This is the Avon. Oh gosh. You really can't read that, can you? Oh. There we go. Moisture Effective Eye Makeup Remover Lotion. Sorry that it took so long to focus. Um, this stuff works really, really well. Um, before I use face wash or anything like that, I just put a little drop on my fingers and I rub it into my eyelashes. Try not to get it in your eye, but you can rub it like, I put my eyelashes down and rub it in like that. It will remove any sort of waterproof mascara, eyeliner, eyeshadow, anything. And I have never had it irritate my eyes at all. So that's a really good bonus. Okay, well, I think that is it. Sorry if this was kind of long and rambly. I didn't mean that. I didn't mean for it to be, but I hope if you wear contacts, this was helpful to you. And now, you have some new things you can try out that might really work for you. Okay, well, have a good day, and happy holidays again. Bye.